Hey guys, welcome to Instant Film Friday. Uh, last week I unboxed and did an initial thought video on the Polaroid 1600 Pro, which is this camera right here. If you haven't checked out that video, definitely go check that out um, from last week. But in that video, I mentioned that when I was on the Facebook Marketplace looking for this camera, I actually found out that Polaroid made what was called the Polaroid 1, which came out a few years before the 1600. It has a similar body style, uh, but it was just a previous camera. So I knew that I wanted it, and I found one on the Facebook Marketplace, and... That is what I am going to be unboxing right now. Huge shout out to Ella from Facebook for sending me this camera. I bought it. It is mine. She also said that she sent another camera with the one, the Polaroid one, because uh, she thought I would get more use out of it. So I'm excited to see the camera that she also sent. So without further ado, I am going to grab some scissors. Be careful with sharp objects because you could cut yourself. Uh, it's packed well. It feels heavy due to the packing materials used. want to open the camera open the box and it's taking a little longer than I expected it to oh there we go so first and foremost ooh so this is not the Polaroid one this is ooh the Polaroid one step flash that is amazing. I am not going to be reviewing this right now, but that is an amazing camera for my collection. I will do a review later. Um, I just want to check to see. Nope, no film. Hmm. I'm going to set that aside. And what I really wanted was this right here, the Polaroid 1. That is awesome. It is in very decent shape. It is not new, but I wasn't expecting it to be. Um, but as you can see, it has the same body style. Let me just uh, hold it side by side. Um, the one has a different top, it looks like. This has more features, the Pro, 1600 Pro. One thing I really like about the Polaroid one as opposed to the one pro i will show you is on the side it has a hand strap that doubles as another a hand strap that you can use to take your picture so i will try that in a sec uh, but with the polaroid 1600 pro it has this hand strap that is made out of a elastic -y material and it kind of has lost its elasticity, so it's kind of loose when you hold it, um, which is just a minor gripe. I would have used something else. I would have liked the option to have a hand strap um, or a neck strap, but that is for another video. So on the back, the controls are minimal. There's a flash option. You can turn it on and off, which you can't with the 1600 series. There is a timer feature. And then the open close feature, which does that. And yeah, the focus range is three feet, which is more than the One Step 600 Pro. But the film door button is right there. You're going to press it. No film on the inside, which I wasn't expecting. Um, but one thing I really like about this camera as well as the Pro is that it has an integrated tripod mount. A lot of Polaroids do not have that tripod mount. And one thing to note is in the uh, 1600 series, the 1600 Classic and the 1600 Ultra do not have tripod mounts. That is a pro feature, which is kind of odd that they put one on the Polaroid 1, which came out prior. So 
it's kind of like a downgrade. Uh, the lens looks pretty clean. Yeah, I'm excited to get to use this. Um, quick story, I ordered a couple packs of film from PolaroidOriginals.com on December 31st, which I knew that I wasn't gonna, it wasn't gonna get shipped out on the 1st because of the holiday, but it is, yeah, what is today? Today is the 10th, and I still don't have my film. How long does it take to send film? I've been in contact with Polaroid. They say my order is fine, it'll be shipped out. Still nothing, so I will keep you guys updated on that. But that is the Polaroid 1. I'm excited to get to use these. I'm taking a trip to Las Vegas in the next few weeks. I'm going to be taking at least one of these cameras because I definitely want to try them out. Uh, so I'll get some real world experience. But I really like the sleek design of these cameras. They make it super easy to just toss into your bag, um, grab and go. Yeah, they're super light. Um, I'm excited to get to use these. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and listening to me rant about the Polaroid 1 and the Polaroid 1600 Pro. Uh, and I will talk to you guys next week.